What is going on guys? How are you guys doing today? And welcome back to Roblox Fire Alarm Inspection number 71. It's been a hot minute since we've done the last Fire Alarm Inspection video and I've been very busy with life and work. Um, so that's really where I haven't been able to upload cons consistently like I wanted to. But hopefully by April, um, I, and I can promise you this, by April, once April comes, uh, my normal recording schedule will be back normal in April. So right now this is just temporary. I'm not. I don't really have enough time to film for you guys due to work. But um, once April comes, my uh, schedule will be back to normal. Hopefully, but it, I I can guarantee you it's gonna be normal. So yeah, sit back, relax, and enjoy this video. And yeah. So as you can probably see behind me, the system. Uh, you can see we have a simplex enunciator that we're using, and it's in French, by the way. Yeah, most of the pull stations are simplex key pull operated pull stations for main reason because this building is active. This building is used for fun for events and all that, and I don't want people tampering with the the the, the system. Um, in here, we replaced. We had it went from a system sensor mask to a Willog Bell to a Willog MT. So we have a Willog MT uh, on right here near the power supply. We have another Willog MT in here near the entrance of the unfinished Starbucks. And over here, the alarms are pretty much the same system sensor. Uh, advances horn only set the code 3. We replaced uh, this alarm. We replaced this with a Willog NS set the code 3. And here, these alarms are the same. Spectre Alert Classics set the code 3. And then in here, replace all the system sensor masses with Woodlock AS wall mount horn strobes. They're all the same. And then, of course, the uh, Woodlock MT is the alarm here is the Woodlock MT, which is the same. And the panel is the same. That's not going to change for a while. So, without further ado, guys, I advise you if you guys are headphone users, I advise you to turn your volume down. And if you guys do have epilepsy, I advise you not to watch this part of the video. So, yeah. Anyways, here we go. Alrighty guys, that's going to wrap it up for Robots Fire Alarm Inspection number 71. Like I said, thank you guys so much for watching. I know it's been a while and I do apologize for that. Um, we are going to start posting more frequently in April and possibly during the summertime. I'm going to start posting more. But other than that guys, I will see you guys in the next system test video whenever that comes around. So thanks you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.